A mind focusing on the present is a gift. Being in the moment, aware of how we think, is key to mindfulness. That is why we are called human beings and not human doings, right? Do you know what mindfulness is? It is simply focusing on the present moment, accepting it, being aware of feelings and thought, and living fully in the present. People ask, how is meditation connected to mindfulness? Well, in meditation, what we are doing is training our mind daily in silence, keep attention where we want it to be. This leads to mindful living in every aspect of life. Mindfulness generates calmness, giving a field of peace, concentration and creativity. As the Buddha says, more than your mother, more than your father, more than your family, a well-trained mind can do greater good. So let's make it our way of life to be mindful. When you open a book, you open your mind. You can truly enjoy an inspiring book when you read out loud at a slow pace, if possible in company, while you allow the words and their meaning to sink in. This is called absorbed reading. There are many benefits to mindful absorbed reading. Here are three. When you read a book, you can immerse yourself in the detail and this nourishes the mind. The more knowledge you have, the better equipped you become to tackle any challenge with this wisdom. And no matter how much stress you have, it all just slips away when you lose yourself in a great page. People ask about the difference between knowledge and wisdom. Knowledge is merely having facts and truths. While wisdom is the practical ability to make consistently good decisions in life. When you know fire is hot and you don't touch it, you have converted knowledge into wisdom. I hope we can make absorbed reading part of our mindful living every day.